You can stick anything you want to the left, right, top or bottom of your website. I've gone to advanced custom positioning, fixed positioning as well on the right with some vertical orientation to fix my social sharing icons. We did this in an earlier video. Look, as I scroll up and down, they're always going to be fixed and you could have menus, you could have anything you want. But what if you don't want the icons to be there right from the start, the get go? You want them to appear later on. Now, why would you do that? Let's pretend we've got a header over here and the header already contains the social sharing icons or a contact button or a subscribe now or whatever, okay? It could be anything you want. Maybe after you've scrolled down, because it's not a sticky header and you can no longer see the social sharing icons, that's when you want these to appear. This is so simple and easy to do and we're not gonna use any CSS code here or anything. We're just gonna click on the social sharing icon. We're gonna make sure we're in the advanced tab we're going to go to motion effects and then we are going to activate a scrolling effect. Okay, we're going to put a scrolling effect on and we are going to go to transparency. And as soon as I do that, the icons have disappeared. That's okay because we actually want it to fade in. We could have fade out, which means it's always visible there and then it disappears after a while. So you could have two levels of fixed icons on your screen, one that's there from the get go and then it disappears as you scroll down and one that appears later on so so versatile or you could have one that fades in and out so it's invisible then it appears then it becomes invisible again mm, you know again you know have a think about if you really want that i'm going to go with the fade in i'm going to set my bottom uh, viewpoint to be zero percent and my top to be a hundred percent as well now watch what happens when i scroll down i, I i'm not I, you know i if you imagine this was my header okay by the time i get to it it starts to appear and look, it's, it, it, and then it becomes more clearer when I get to this point. Now, the reason it's doing that is because I've currently set it to be 100%. So if I now shrink this down to be, say, 48%, I only have to go about this far here, 48% before you now it becomes um, fully visible. So I'm going to now take this down even more. Let's go to 25%. Watch this. 25% of the screen and now it becomes visible. So this is gonna help you understand how the viewpoint works. Let me just shrink this all the way to say 76%. It will not appear until we get right down there. Can you see we're now down to 75, 76% point of the page? Is that making sense with the viewpoint? I would actually prefer it to be, let me get back in. I would prefer it to be something like that, say 30%. So as I scroll down, I get to this point here and now it appears and it's a nice transition in and out. That is a really simple way of having icons or buttons or things on your page appear. And remember, you could do this with any widget, okay? It is super simple in making things appear in and out if you want. In fact, let me just show you what the in out one's like. There we go. Let's go for the in out, okay? Watch this, okay? So as I scroll, oh, sorry, let me just do this. <laughs> sorry, that was the wrong one. There we go. Right. So if I just change this viewpoint to be about 20% and about, I don't know, let's go, let, let's just shrink these down a little bit like that, okay? This is the fade in and out. It fades in, and look, as I get to the bottom, it starts to fade out when we get to about the 77 point. So if I wanted it to fade out quicker, I could have done this so it like it fades in, and then look, it now starts to fade out. But I personally prefer the fade in approach. Um, I just think it works so much better when you've got something that you don't want to appear straight away, but you definitely want it to be clearly there as you start moving on on the page. Hey, I hope you like, subscribe, share and follow and I'll see you soon.